AI slop bothers everybody, but inside of the Fortune 500, AI slop gets people fired. Now you're a $2 billion plus and growing rapidly company. There was so much surface area you could cover with Ryder. At the end of the day, you're mm -hmm. building agentic AI that can do things like write front office facing emails. You're focusing on companies that are heavy in compliance, healthcare, financial services. That's a lot of surface area already. How do you maintain focus? I feel like a hype woman at all times. And the only way I can explain to people how powerful it is, is to literally give them a laptop that looks like their own. And I have them do something really hard on it using our technology. And it's just so shocking to them that it's excellent, right? That they can trust it, that they can source it and cite it, that they can interact with it. The agent that talks back to them is fucking smart. A lot of the, the trust we build is by not trying to do anything else other than make these customers successful. If you look at the hyperscalers, you know, they're really trying to sell compute. Our ability to go in and say, we are the only full stack player that is not trying to do anything else. And a lot of that is really questioning the assumptions around business process and org design and the calcification of legacy systems, right? The way we build trust is to really never be selling anything beyond that and to challenge the customer the way that we challenge ourselves.